Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am the Grand Cat and today we're going to be looking at the WCF Iceberg figure. This is of course a second hand, came from Liberty Akihabara and cost 700 yen. I've also decided to move the camera so that it works with the light rather than against it. So the camera setup is a little bit different than we normally have. But without any further ado, let us get into opening Iceberg. The reason why we're opening Iceberg today, uh, rather than any of the other literally hundreds of WCF figures that we've got is because Iceberg is a deck in the One Piece trading card game and the other place you'll see these, other than these unboxings, is the TCG games that are played <clears throat> on the channel and Iceberg happens to be a, a deck. One time he was not a very good deck and suddenly he became a very very strong deck. So that was unusual. But there he is, there's big old Iceberg himself, the manager of all of Water 7, and someone who, depending on what One Piece theories that you align to, may hold a very prevalent role in the end of One Piece, because he has the idea to make all of Water 7 float, which may be very, very important, as we've just had an announcement from a certain scientist, that at some point, maybe the world of One Piece will be entirely sunk under water. So, Iceberg may very well be relevant by the time this video actually goes up. Sometimes these videos are recorded months in advance. But you can take a hint of whereabouts the manga was at the point of recording. But there we are folks, that's it for this little video. I really hope that you all enjoyed, and if you did enjoy it, please give me a like, share and subscribe. And if you are subscribed, make sure you click that notification icon so you can see when more of these glorious little videos go out. And we shall see you all in the next video. Goodbye everybody.